Once upon a time there was a noble king who had four queens. He loved his fourth queen the most and used to load her with expensive clothes and feed her the best food. Load her with beautiful clothes and cook the best food. He only gave her the best. He also loved his third wife very much and used to talk to her in the surrounding states. But she feared that one day she would leave him for someone else. He also loved his second wife and she was his companion and always had sympathy, respect and patience with him. Whenever the king had any problem, he would tell her so that he could tell the king the solution to that problem. The king's first wife was the king's most loyal and helped greatly in increasing the kingdom and his wealth. However, he did not love his first wife. Once the king fell ill and realized that he had less time, so he asked his fourth wife, I have loved you the most. And you have been rewarded with the best things, and you have been taken care of the most. Now that I am going to die, will you come with me to support me? Then his fourth wife replied that no. His words pierced the king's heart like a knife. Now the sad king asked his third wife that I have loved you all my life. Now I am going, will you go with me? No. The third wife replied, Life is very good and when you die, I will get married again. Now the king's heart was sitting and he was cold. Then he asked his second wife, I always asked your help in times of need and you always supported me. When I die, will you come with me to support me? I'm sorry, I can't help you this time. The second wife replied, At best I can leave you to your grave. His answer sounded like lightning to the cave. In end he became very sad. Then a voice came, I will walk with you and go wherever you go. When the king turned his eyes, his first wife was standing. She was very weak because she did not eat. Filled with sorrow, the king said that when I had the opportunity, I should have taken better care of you. Friends, we get to learn from this story that our fourth wife is our body. No matter how much we put our heart into decorating it, it will leave us at the time of death. Our third wife is our wealth status and wealth. When we die, it is passed on to others. Our Dasuri wife is our family and family. No matter how much she is with us, more and more she will come with us to the crematorium, but not beyond that. Our first wife is our soul who often becomes unconscious of wealth, strength and ego. But our soul is the only one that will go wherever we go. That's why grow it, make it strong and take care of it from today. This is your biggest gift in the world.